Candy, <clears throat> Candy, Lenise Burris Tucker. All right, two R's and two S's. Y'all know we love Candy over here. I love me some Candy. Hey, Candy. She is definitely a hard worker, and she is a, a jack of all trades. Maybe a master. Well, definitely a master of songwriting. I'm not going to say a master of none. But anyway, this ain't about Candy herself. This is about her restaurant, OLG, once again getting a badass rating from the food uh, uh, health department, from the health department when it comes to the food. All right, OLG, Old Lady Gang, the restaurant that's supposed to represent her, it, it, uh, not her, her mama and Nora and Aunt Bertha and, you know, women that could actually cook. It's supposed to represent them. And this is it's going down bad. It's going down kind of sad. Now, one of the OLGs have been shot up. This one getting a bad health rating. I think Blaze, that 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 day, you got to stop naming restaurants after people, Candy, because you know, you're not doing them any good. <laughs> Bitch, you better snap. Hold, snap, 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 snap. Now, hold on, hold on. Let me get over here. Me. Because you deserve a lashing candy for that C rating with, with, with their health when it comes to that food. You know better than that shit. I never made my video about Blaze Steak and Seafood because I was trying to be nice. But I'm a, I, 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 I think I'm going to do it. But I'm going to tell you this. It was trash. It was trash. And I was highly disappointed. And it was expensive garbage. It said, as a matter of fact, I would have rather went to Applebee's had you chew up your food, throw it back out like a bird and ate that, and that would have tasted better than this shit that they served us at Blaze. Can I keep it real tonight? Are y'all okay if I keep it real tonight? I already told you, I went to Blaze. The liquor was great. The food was trash, cold, unseasoned and let me say this about you southern restaurants down here in atlanta a lot of y'all that's opening these restaurants i don't believe y'all from the south either that or y'all need to connect to the ancestors into big mom because you ain't got big mama in them back there cooking maybe we don't have big mama no more that's why that food don't truly taste like southern food what 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 in the hell is wrong with y'all i'm going to these southern restaurants soul food restaurants they ain't got no seasoning they ain't got no hot sauce they putting the greens with the cornbread and they asking me if i want to separate now what the who raised y'all niggas this is a whole new breed that's down here i don't believe all y'all from the south i think some of y'all came down here from new york chicago uh indianapolis ohio and then y'all opened up soul food restaurant they ain't no way y'all from the south running around here i went to a southern restaurant down here and they didn't have no hot sauce and i'm trying to figure out how in the hell is that possible how 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 we all grew up with either crystal or louisiana hot sauce on the damn table and if and, and if the money was just that type you know you had the store brand version of that but it was crystal or louisiana hot sauce nonetheless y'all got it up down here and so when it comes to olg she keeps getting a c rating at the restaurant right now you may say c I got C's in school. C's get degrees, and so do these. But you don't want that when it comes to your food. All right? The C grade doesn't mean average. It is far below average. To get a C grade, the restaurant may have more than four critical foodborne illness violations. More than four. Four foodborne illness violations. Do you know what that means? That means bubble guts for a week, bitch. That means you ain't going to work. That means your booty hole is finna be on fire. That means you finna get a ripped eight pack from everything coming out from the front and the back. Her food finna clean you out more than the KR the, than the Keisha KR fitness tea. And that food clean you. That 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 cleanse cleans you out. Hey Keisha. I still want to know, do you use that tea to keep that was just that small? Or did you get a couple ribs removed? I, I, I want to know, but I'm going to tell you. That Keisha K. Or Fitness Detox Tea ain't nothing like it. But Candy's Restaurant, with all the foodborne illnesses, is going to have you even more snatch. Even more. You might even die. Allegedly. 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 So, let me go back. Let me go back to reading. Let me go back. Because there is, a, wait, 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 or perhaps more than a dozen non-critical good retail practice violations. More than a dozen. Oh, how low class. Let's go back. Let's go back. Because there is such a variability in the range of C-grade restaurants into even the playing field to achieve grading fairness for restaurants across the municipal lines, we created a normalized grading system. Oh, my God, girl. They grade y'all on a curve and y'all still failing. Get y'all shit together. 
When you come in to work, don't bring your damn quick trip cups and put it on the counter. Oh, I ain't read the worst to y'all yet. I'm still being nice. You bring your purse in, put have a designated space for that. You can't be playing on your phone and making food at the same time. And let me get on y'all restaurants about this, too, because I be seeing a lot of y'all. Y'all be thinking I'll be seeing y'all, but I be saying y'all. I just don't be saying that because I'm already two, three drinks in. And I be, I be scared. Y'all going to be spitting my shit. Listen. What's the point of having gloves if you're going to play on your nasty-ass phone with your gloves on and then go back to cooking, but your gloves is on? So your bare hands never touched my chicken, but all of the bacteria on your phone screen did. What sense does that make? What sense does it make? Can somebody tell me? Can can y'all tell me? Because I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying, I'm trying to figure it out. All right, all right, all right. We back to it. We back to it. We back to it. The patenting process is based upon a curve. I, I, I forgot that part was even in there. A curve and you still fail it. With the goal of keeping the number of CDF restaurants in a single digits. Basically, basically, they still trying to help y'all out and y'all are falling short. So here is the problem, okay? Um, when it comes to OLG in particular, they had several issues. Issue number one, the food was not cooked to the appropriate temperature. So if you want you some good fried chicken, you're going to get you a side of salmonella with it too. Mm -mm Mm-mm-mm. In addition to a little salmonella that's going to have you out of work for a week, the cleaning solutions were not properly labeled and mixed with the food. So damn. I thought I was getting me a side of mashed potatoes with gravy, but it had a little bleach in it. Damn. Now, I know Cardi talked about putting bleach in offset cereal, but I don't want it in my mashed potatoes. I didn't do nothing to you, Candy. I didn't cheat on you. Now, to put a bowl. Wait a minute. Who texted me? Who texted me? Oh, okay. To put a bowl on all of this. OLG has had several chances to fix these issues at their restaurants, and they still keep coming up at a C. The Blaze restaurant, which I think is shut down now, I cut that, cut down the middle of their, their food. It was raw. They hurried up and started bringing me more plates when they figured out who I was, and I know I got some subbies that work at Blaze. This is no shade to y'all. This is no shade. Y'all did a good job serving, but whoever was cooking was utter garbage. That drink, the, the drinks was good though. So if you gonna go to Candy's restaurants, get drunk first, then go, and, and just be prepared to take that two, three week vacation because you will be shitting out everything you ever ate since your childhood. Everything coming out, including that gum that you swallowed when you was nine, that's coming out too. Got my cards all mixed up fucking with you, Candy. Just like you got them cleaning solutions mixed up with that damn food. Fix your shit. 